It exceeded all expectations. Ford says interest in the new F-150 sure. Lightning is so high, it's actually doubling down on electric cars. Pretty crazy. Now the automaker making a big move to increase production on it. Business editor Rob Maloney live tonight with that story. Rod, it's been a hit. It is. It's been a hit, Devin. It was just a year ago this week that Ford announced that they were just going to expand the Rouge plant and put in an electric vehicle manufacturing section there. It was risky at the time, but now the demand is so high, they're expanding yet again. Ford Motor is surprised by the number of orders for the new F-150 Lightning. Ford's president of the Americas, Camargo Haltra, told a large and supportive crowd at the Rouge truck plant this morning. We already have received more than 150,000 customer reservations for the all-new F-150 Lightning since it was re re released and revealed in May. So what do you do? Well, you expand the plant. They'll spend a quarter of a billion dollars to enlarge the Rouge Electric Vehicle Center, which sits inside the F-150 truck plant. This will also create 450 new jobs, those jobs getting split between the Rouge, the Van Dyke Electric Powertrain Center in Sterling Heights, and the Rossonville Components Plant, where they'll make the batteries. This new investment and these added jobs will allow us to increase F-150 Lightning production to 80,000 trucks. Which should happen by the end of 2023, which is well ahead of the original schedule. To guide House Insights auto analyst Sam Abel Samid, this is an encouraging development for Ford and the risk automakers are taking in jumping in with both feet into the electric vehicle commitment. Getting this up and running in just 12 months is pretty impressive. Um, and the fact that you know they are they've already doubled their planned production capacity for this truck. So now they're in pre-production. They gave us the plant tour. In fact, you saw some pictures of that just, uh, just in the piece there. But in the meantime, uh, the United Auto Workers very happy with this. Um, you know, new jobs is always a good thing for them. And it's likely you'll see those pre-production vehicles probably scooting around town here in the next couple of weeks. Back to you. Yeah, and Rod, I know a lot of folks wondering, when are we likely to see the Lightning in showrooms? Uh, May 2022 is the scheduled date. Uh, we're not sure if they're ahead or not, but that's when the thought is that they'll get there. All right. Thank you, Rod.